At this year's DSEI event in London, Aerolus, a UK-based aerospace company, unveiled their latest designs for a series of modular jet aircraft. Since then, many have recognized the potential of their modular approach to reshape military aviation capabilities. In this video, we're taking a closer look at Aerolus's modular light jet design and its role in advancing next-generation military aircraft. Let's dive right in. The concept behind Aerolus's modular approach is rooted in addressing the challenges faced by air forces in managing a variety of single-point aircraft designs, each with its unique logistical and training demands, as explained on their website. This guiding principle has led to a groundbreaking, modular design, enabling multiple configurations such as the Advanced Jet Trainer, the Aggressor and Companion variants, and an ISTAR version, among others. All of these configurations are built upon a common base known as the Common Core Fuselage, or CCF, which enables customers to expand their platform's capabilities by acquiring additional modules tailored to their precise requirements at that given moment. The chief airframe engineer emphasized that they're not just offering a single aircraft, but a versatile system. This system can serve as a jet trainer, quickly adapt to function as a reconnaissance plane, or transform into a fighter jet. Their goal is to create a flying product that maximizes shared components and structures, while allowing for modular upgrades to offer various specialized capabilities within a largely standardized fuselage. The latest version of Aerolus's CCF boasts a design that allows for increased fuel capacity and improved electronic capabilities, ensuring durability, ease of maintenance, and performance improvements. Moreover, the redesign of the fuselage and the introduction of new wings eliminate the need for custom landing gear, a feature of previous versions. Instead, the aircraft will now utilize readily accessible commercial off-the-shelf landing gear, streamlining maintenance procedures, and substantially cutting down on related expenses. Aerolus's versatile cockpit design has several configurations too. In the single-seat configuration, there is space for electromagnetic warfare capabilities or increased fuel capacity, while the dual-seat setup allows for an additional pilot. Incorporating a complete combat radar within the nose cone significantly bolsters the aircraft's combat capabilities for ISTAR and EW setups, rendering it equally proficient in actual operational missions and training exercises. While some have raised concerns about the company's ambitious claims, Aerolus has been proactive in forging partnerships with major companies such as Honeywell, Thales, Rolls-Royce, Siemens, and various others. The company also secured around $13 million in funding from a Middle Eastern sovereign wealth fund and signed multiple contracts with the UK Ministry of Defence. In February 2021, the Royal Air Force awarded Aerolus a three-year contract for research and development, underscoring the military's interest in this innovative technology. The aircraft is slated to become operational later in this decade. Do you believe that modularity is the future of military aviation? Let's discuss in the comments below. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to our channel for the latest defense news and analyses.